Previously. And now we continue. Hey soldiers, hey, welcome back to our Fall 57 remake. Oh my gosh, look at that beautiful face. Look at that beautiful face. All right, so the last part, we kind of gave the run around. We went up, we basically up there. We walked around a bit. We met Aerith and Sephiroth. Oh, Sephiroth. Oh, he always knows how to push my buttons. So now we're the train ride going home. We met with Aerith. We're about to go home and meet Aerith. And, I mean, I'll be Tiffa. Like, hey, Tiffa. What's up? So we're gonna, we're gonna need you to join my party real quick to kick shit with that. So don't forget to click that subscribe button. Ugh, click that subscribe button. And the bell to go inside to see notified. And let's fucking do this. Ah, excuse me, Barbie. Barbie, don't worry about me. Hope the others need you. Just, uh, you know, guy with the giant ass sword on the train. Don't worry. Don't mind me, though. It's just, uh, I'm a computer. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry, pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. You know, you know me. Hey, <laughs> love the NCA. What's up? What's up? Just leave me alone, all right? Wait, what? You're uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector Eight. Yeah. I'm a soldier. Wow, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to, or. Maybe not. You see, my daughter now lives in Sector 8, so... Uh, pardon me, excuse me, excuse me. Uh, Little help, Cloud, please? Oh, I'm sure Sector 7's affected. I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Mm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Um, sure. <laughs> hey, don't mind me. Just a guy with a giant minigun for an arm. What kind of maniac? go so far as to bomb a reactor. <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <sighs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. <clears throat> J just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Mm. <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't antagonize you. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear, y'all's masters. <laughs> we will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Them spiking words. <laughs> it's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. What <laughs> about <laughs> <laughs> those two digging a fuck? <laughs> like, I would have that exact same reaction if a guy with a giant fucking mini guard started talking to me. I would have that exact same fucking you reaction. You hear that suit? Shinra creed my ass. Yeah, sure. It's, uh, maybe next time, cool it, because you know we are technically on the run, and you do have a you're not being really inconspicuous right now with the giant fucking mini gun arm. You're not really being, you know, incognito. Oh, oh, we're good. Oh, we're about to do the fucking the train check shit. Oh. Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? 
I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID <coughs> checkpoint shortly. Yep, there we go. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <coughs> Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> That's what's always worked for me. Well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. Foreshadowing! I smell foreshadowing! Oh, God, guys, I, oh, if I, if I remember correctly, we go to, uh, we go to the seventh, uh, seventh heaven bar. We talk to Tiffa, blah, 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 and then I believe, fuck, I forgot, I forgot, like, I forgot when we actually go to Eric. Oh, sweet swap. Hey, over here! Oh, you guys! Oh, Daddy! Oh, sweetheart! I'm so glad you're home! Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, Thank goodness. <laughs> Knew it couldn't be that bad. No way. <laughs> Hot damn, we are good! <laughs> yes! Bombs detonated one, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, ah. God. Ah. Hm. Now get some r, r You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh. At Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works? Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. Oh, you see, I won't make Tifa wait. I won't really want to make her wait, because only because she would kick my ass. What? You were late? Time to get this fucking seventh head and fist in the face. Oh, fuck. No. She fucking put the slots. Fucking perfect on all the slots. Oh, fuck. No. Beat rush, dolphin blow, somersault kick. Oh yeah, we're gonna so knocks me out. Why did we have to go? Oh gosh, this is the slumps. What kind of apparently Shinra thinks it's a world. Oh. Don't play these on the mm. I've never seen anything like it before. Oh, they really uh I really love how they like right, made the slumps feel so alive. Huh? Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> 
Mako junkie, huh? Figures. You again. Um, buddy, you do realize you live in, a, in the shit part of town, right? Like, up there, everyone's living peaceful, luxurious lives. While down here, you're in the shitter. Yeah, buddy, I don't... Don't think that's a good kind of problem. Hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's... Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. Oh, I want to get a little extra grinding in. I want to grind. Just a tad bit. Just a little bit of grind. Just a, may I have a smudge of grind, sir? Please. Just a smudge of grind. Oh. Here we go. Oh, it's like seven slums. If I remember correctly, there is a weapon shop. There's a, there's a weapon shop around here. Which there's a weapon shop, there's a material shop, and then an item shop. I believe it was also like in. in on top of the tower, there's like materia. Wait, one this of the is buildings, real? I believe. It's not a movie? How long is it gonna keep burning? What do you know? Dude, yeah, it really yeah. brought life into the place. I want a drink with tea. Oh, yeah, it's so bad. Who wouldn't? She's a looker. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You don't want to say that in front of her. Trust me, she would, uh, she would kick all your ass. Tifa! Tifa! How's it going? <gasps> Arlene. <gasps> <laughs> Daddy, you're home! That's right, Angel, I Welcome am! Back. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Yeah, I've been helping <laughs> Tifa. Oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. <laughs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? So... Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Alright, so, the money... Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? what? <laughs> yeah, you. Oh, uh, yeah, look at that. that, that that's not suspicious at all. Look, look at that. That not suspicious. That not suspicious one bit. Oh, wait, what? Falcon... Falcano Bob? Gold time pinball. Uh, oh, the chocobos! Look at that! Oh, the fucking bomb bomb. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm love you. Yeah. Oh, chocobo. Uh. Hey, what uh, the hell do you think you're doing, scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, braid. About that, we should talk outside. <sighs> oh, you don't actually have my money. Um, Daddy, uh, did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Um, <laughs> oh, lucky here. Um, not my money. Look. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. 
The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. Yeah, but about the money. <laughs> How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Danger's part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. I'm always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. Yeah, after what after what they did to you, Klaus? So, yeah. you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. What? I totally am. Come on, I totally am. Cloud Strike? He's totally a people person. Like I saw Sector kinda. 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. It was a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, yeah, it was. It was, it was like oh, a fucking war right. zone. But, you know, <laughs> media! The media does say a lot of crazy shit. Cough, cough. And quick, here we road. are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Thanks. So, about my money, like I said before. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Yeah, cool. So, money? <laughs> Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No, it's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. Um... Um... I'm trying to remember, like, uh, why would... Just... Uh, I... uh -oh. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. Oh, uh, if you want anything else, we can always there get There's one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2000 remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. Jeez, Klaus, stop being a dick. <laughs> I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Jeez, Thanks Klaus, again for stop everything. being a fucking... Sleep tight. What is Klaus being a dick? Like... <sighs> I get 2,000, but still, like... <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> the way Cloud gets better, I promise. Cloud actually gets better. Guess it's time for introductions. Oh, the fuck? Uh, yeah, we all, we all been there, dude. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of guess what that is. Ugh, trust me, trust me, dude, we all been there. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. What are 
you doing to Marco? This is his apartment. He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Oh, he's a Sephiroth club. Oh, we... Reunion, reunion, guys. <laughs> How do you sleep with that giant ass shoulder piece? Like, actually, how do you sleep with that giant ass shoulder piece? Please tell me, like, how do you get any sort of rest with that on? Fuck that. Like, I would take literally all that shit off before I even think about sleeping. But yeah, I don't, like, pay very close attention to those guys in the hood and when they say reunion. Pay very close attention to that. I don't, I'm not gonna spoil it, but let's just say. It's a plays a well, huge now, part of this game. You must be Cloud. Yep, that's me. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her... I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Oh yeah, but we're gonna do that in the next part, guys. When we come back, we're going, we're going over to Seventh Heaven, talking to Tifa, and... Uh, fuck, I totally forgot what happened. I know we go talk to Tifa, we go into the secret base. And I totally actually forgot what happened. Like, I know we definitely go to Seventh Heaven, and we definitely... Good Searching for but I totally forgot what happened next. So let's don't forget to click that subscribe button and that cool bell to get our sites notified. And I'll be see you guys in the next part. Peace out, everyone. Searching for